many complex nerve injuries or nerve pain problems uh, don't have clear or straightforward solutions. Oftentimes patients have seen multiple doctors in multiple different locations before coming to see us. We felt strongly that a team-based approach is the best way to manage patients with these sorts of problems because it helps us to make sure that we can think about all the options or pathways that are available and to help come up with the best approach to solving these problems for people that sometimes don't often have a lot of hope. A lot of times there are things that we can do to help and by getting our heads together in a room and thinking about the different ways that we can help fix these problems, we're oftentimes able to come up with solutions that wouldn't always be available at first glance. When a nerve is cut, it can continue to send signals to the brain even if it no longer has a target. It's almost like a live wire at the end of a residual limb. Sometimes that can lead to very painful sensations, both from direct palpation or touching on the, on the cut nerve, or with residual limb sensations or phantom limb pain. There are some options that we have that we can uh, sometimes try to help alleviate some of those symptoms. Sometimes we can plan for surgeries at the time of an amputation to help decrease the risk of pain, but if pain has developed after an amputation, there are some options we have to try and help with that. The surgeons who are part of the nerve clinic have specialized expertise, experience, and interest in helping to take care of patients with complex nerve injuries and nerve pain. We take care of patients with very complex nerve injuries, whether they're due to trauma or after amputation or residual nerve pain that can develop after injuries or previous surgeries. 